It's a beautiful balmy evening on Plymouth Hoe, and it's the 9th of May. It's the 9th of May 2016 and it's a uh, day after a nice sunny weekend uh, and I've been in Exeter and it's been good. And uh, back at the house of Jet Built, chatting up with Marl Norton's Trick of the Week. With that rainbow flag again, Mark again. Hello Mark, how are you? He just keeps rolling. Hello. Hello. Welcome to the land of Golden runny noses! Is that what a nose is for? <laughs> yes, if your nose runs and your feet smell, you're built upside down. If your nose runs, it might be athletic. Uh, uh, noses run in my family. Pardon? <gasps> noses run in my... Oh, forget it. <laughs> That's the big noses for them, they see their car. And did you hear about the man who was deaf and got arrested and put in prison uh, falsely? No. He got a royal pardon. What? Pardon? Eh? <laughs> Never mind, ladies and gentlemen. I've had, and a, very I've had a very gay weekend. Have you? Yes, I'm sure you have. <laughs> I went to Exeter Gay Pride. <sighs> and it was quite exciting. Good. Well, now you've got to be serious this week. Okay? That's a cloud this on the is horizon, a... isn't it? Oh, you see, you start, you try, you both. I know I'm very sorry. Sign, sign of dementia, right now. I know, I know Quite. I'm very sorry. No, listen, it's a sign of highly intellectual. Yeah, I wish I hadn't told you that. But there you go. What we have here so are. What's do with idle hands? Two um, souvenirs uh, from the should Titanic. Say, should I put a translation of this? <laughs> you might need it. This, this pen belonged to one of the passengers who survived. The so it belonged to one of the passengers that survived of the what Titanic. Yes, and this. Okay. Did I um, say that? Not that I should have told you that bit. And uh, this is uh, a button from one of the tunics of the crew of the Titanic. It's not from a pantomime then, because button always goes to the pantomime. When we finish this, you're going to say, "I wish I hadn't pissed about." This is serious. This okay, is. it is. Sorry. Dead, okay. Deadly serious. Uh, um, uh, at the end of this, you're going to say, oh, that's spooky. So I'd, it's, it's I'd like you, if you the, will, the, just the, to. The uh, no. These, the, all, all these, incidentally, are pictures of people who were on that voyage. Oh, sorry. It is serious. Uh, so please yeah, just reach down and grab hold of that little button. And, and I'd like you, for the small process of what we're about to go through, to. Just hold it in your hand and get the feeling, the I can feel emotions. Something. I can feel something coming through. Good. I'm beginning Good. to rock and roll. Good, I'm, I'm glad about that. Now I'm going to show you these pictures one at a time. I feel a nice bit. And hopefully you'll get a bit of a feeling about some of them. Maybe not all of them. I love a good feeling. M maybe only a few of them. But if you get a feeling, I want you to say yes. I'm and always getting a feeling. If you don't, I want you to say no. Okay? And if you say yes, we'll put it here. Okay. If not, we'll discard it. So How uh, many times can I say that? Whenever you get the feeling, it's just a, a thing of I'm feeling. I'm always getting the feeling, though. So, well, do you get a positive feeling or a yes. negative feeling? Yes. Yes, you're getting a positive oh, feeling. Yes. Uh, and this one? Oh yes. Uh -huh. No. No. He no, looks no, stern. No. A bit stern. Oh, oh, okay. He looks a bit of the ponce as well. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Shouldn't have said that. Um, quite sophisticated. No, no. Okay. That's a... I'll go for yes for that. Yeah. Uh, no. No. Oh. I'm going for the looks. She's quite nice. Go on. Okay. Yes. No, she looks a better laps. Oh, okay. The big um, moustache. He looks as though she'll be selling kiwi shoe polish. Okay, go on. Yeah. Yeah, she looks nice. Okay. Motherly-like. Yes. Yeah. No. Um, no, no, you're no the beard's too long. I wouldn't the, trust him. The beard's too long. I could put Put him out. It's probably about halfway through there, so just just pop the button back on top of that little pile of uh, there. Okay, and now I want you to hold on to the pen. This is this is getting uh, dual coordination. Oh yeah, well activity, and I'm not lady. Well, no, I'm just be. trying to improve your skills. Okay, okay. <clears throat> so keep holding that whilst we go through these few pictures. 
And, uh, Am I supposed I, to remember the faces? No, no, just just if you get the feeling. That's um, all this is about. He looks quite working class. Yes, look of yes for him. Yeah. No pons. Yeah. Uh, yes, motherly. He looks like a no. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 No. Yes. No. 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 Uh, oh, sorry. Yes. 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 Thank yeah. you. Uh, okay. Where's Leo? Leo is not amongst them. I, 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 I fear these are people that you've decided that you've decided weren't um, necessarily uh, those there. Yeah. Whatever. Are, 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 are all your nose? Well, but you, got three piles but you did get. Oh, so they, are, do you want your pen back? I want my pen back. That's how okay. I get them. Okay. Okay. And we'll pop them on there. Now, uh, as I, I shouldn't have told you this before because it may have influenced your uh, feeling, but as Ooh. I said, this belonged to a lady who survived the Titanic. This came off the tunic of one of the uh, dead crewmen. Oh, crumbs. Seriously? Now, this is why, whilst you held on to this pen, hopefully you got positive vibes about these pictures. Uh, for example, on the back here it says, uh, this is Mr Richard Williams, who was... Only 21, believe it or not. Mm. And uh, tells you all about him and the fact that he survived. Thank you. As did uh, Elizabeth here. She survived. And birth, but birth. That's amazing. And Estelle, she survived. John survived. As did Richard. Ethel. Alex. Well, like Ethel, it's too late, she's already and been soon. George. That's amazing, well done <clears throat> to them. Now, of course, uh, over here, you were holding on to this button. They're the ones that didn't. When you went through these and, unfortunately, uh, all of these people, you got okay, the right so feeling, didn't survive. There's a song there somewhere, I will survive. I don't wonder if they recorded that for the Titanic. Yeah. And over here, of course, we're all the odd ones that uh, you just didn't get a feeling for, but some of them survived, some of them died, but you just didn't get the feeling for those. Oh, so clever. Not a problem. Nothing to sniff at. Ladies and gentlemen. And so, I wish you all <clears throat> happy sailing, and may your <clears throat> colds be small ones. And if you start singing a tune, it'll help you. No, it won't. Tunes do not make easily. me breathe more easily. Are you sure? Yes. Yeah. So until next week. Have you got that sinking feeling? Yeah, apparently my dad was on the Titanic. I can smell Vic. Apparently he went down very well. <laughs> <laughs> yes, until then. Sail away. Sail away, sail away, sail away. Which if you lived in Plymouth, you've heard thousands of times over the last couple of weeks. Yep.
time I'll let you go And every time I'll let you go Darling, I don't know Thanks to Mal Norton with his trick of the week from Plymouth Barbican, the house that Jack built. You can find Mal Norton on Facebook. You can also find him on the website details here. This has been a Chris McField Media Production 2016. You can contact me, sponsor me and support me through PayPal at ChristopherSummerfield at gmail.com. Thanks for watching this rather entertaining video. Music on the video is by Chris Oxland. You can also find Chris Oxland on Facebook and at Oxy Music, SoundCloud. It's a lifestyle thing.